I don't know how you like your fries. You like your fries with or without salt? And that's W-I-T apostrophe. Do you need your McDonald's fries with salt like me? All right, just say yes, salty fries, son. In the comment section below, lock it in with a thumbs up. Yes, salty fries at Mickey D's, son. Hey, fam, if you like me, you need answers too. McDonald's, talk to me. I know I didn't see what I thought I just saw when I saw it. Is this going to be the very last run of McDonald's McRib ever? Like, no more McRib after this, baby. If you're a lover and a big fan of the McDonald's McRib, after this, it might be over. It might be over. McDonald's, talk to me. You guys, do you guys see that? Right there, baby. McRib farewell tour. This could be your last bite. I'm gonna do my best to get y'all some answers. Cause a lot of you guys out there love the McRib every time it drops, every time it comes out, you're already up on it. McDonald's, are you bowing out to Arby's? I did put up Arby's challenge McDonald's McRib the other day. I put that up, you can watch the video. I'm gonna try to link it below. But that might be a real challenge. Like McDonald's took one to the chin. Did you take one to the chin from Arby's and you said, this is it? We can't do it no more? McDonald's, what up? Oh, I can help you. Yeah, can I order your McRib? Uh, yeah, I'll get, I'll get the meal large with a water. Hey, real quick. So this is the last McRib. You ain't gonna be doing it no more. Okay. Is this the final run of the McRib? It says McRib farewell tour. Oh, I'm not sure. I'm uh, not sure. Yeah. Hi. Right. <laughs> so this meal? Yep. All right. Let me see this. All right. Thanks. Baby girl at the speaker. She didn't know. She wasn't too sure if this is gonna be the last McRib. Though it said McRib's farewell tour, like it's going away. Is it just going away? for 2022 and then coming back 2023 like it always does it always comes back next year or is it going away indefinitely y'all but i'm gonna ask homegirl over here at the window mm -hmm. i love your videos by the way i appreciate it and hey, let me ask you i noticed the sign said the mcrib farewell tour is this like the last run for the mcrib that they don't know they, that, that's just a promotion for it i guess so all right, all right. my mother loves watching your videos no, nah, tell mom I said thank you. You're hilarious. <laughs> and we're just waiting on the road. All right. So we're well, gonna park you because the road's Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. I'm gonna pull oh. up to like two or three. Baby girl's like, yo, damn the McRib. <laughs> Me and my moms love watching you. Oh man. McDonald's farewell tour. Now the farewell tour, I mean that could probably mean a lot of things. You know what I'm saying? You're thinking of a tour like, you know, this tour is only gonna come to select areas, you know, for the music. You're gonna go see your favorite artist perform and all that good stuff. And uh, this is me over here getting right, but I'm still wrong. Hold on a second. I'm still wrong. I gotta, gotta hit the needle wop. The needle wop wop. Rockety rock poppity don't stop. All right, boom. All right, boom. Turn that off. Turn that off because we got to get into this. I don't even want to hold you, family. I don't even want to hold you. But boop, boop. All in your face. Hard to replace. McDonald's is with their McRib for October. They said they were going to drop it late October. This is late October. A lot of you should be able to get your hands on it. But... Is that the smell of me getting fatter? No, nah, not really. It's just hot. Ooh, oh. It's hot. It's hot. Oh, hello. I love. Y'all did me dirt. Y'all did me dirt. I mean, you did me love, but you did me dirt and love at the same time, McDonald's. And this is my favorite McDonald's. Everybody know that. There's only one McDonald's that's mad dumb popular out my way. And that's the one over here on Martin Luther King Boulevard, New Britain, Connecticut. The best McDonald's there is. I ain't going to stunt. That's the one I go to. Everybody else is okay. But this one up over here, joints be always fresh as they can get. Anyway, um, let me tell you something. We already know about McDonald's french fries, right? And y'all know the hack. Y'all know the trick. Y'all know the tip. If you want fresh french fries at any McDonald's, it really doesn't matter. Tell them no salt. Tell them no salt up front. That made they, they got to make it fresh because they normally salt the ones they already have out there. No salt. You get them dumb fresh. These are the dumb fresh edition. But nobody salted them. Nobody put no salt on them. I'm getting no salt. Ugh, hot. They hot and they butt naked. High and butt. How you high and butt naked? Well, I understand how you could be high and butt naked in certain situations. But these are hot and butt naked. And I need salty clothes on my fries. I need salt salt on my joints. Like, 
The regular McDonald's fries, butt naked. Mm -hmm. I need mine with salt. I don't know how you like your fries. You like your fries with or without salt? And that's W-I-T apostrophe. Do you need your McDonald's fries with salt like me? All right, just say yes. Salty fries, son. In the comment section below, lock it in with a thumbs up. Yes, salty fries at Mickey D's, son. Boom, lock it in with a thumbs up. Or just say without. That's W-I-T apostrophe O-U-T, without, all right? Oh, my goodness. I had to put them down because... That's just not my particular cup of tea, you know? <laughs> With ginseng. <laughs> the ghetto net. The ghetto net. The ghetto net. Ooh! Rockin' to the beat. Bill, 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 bill. The ghetto net. The ghetto net. With no salt. Ah! The ghetto net. Ooh! Rockin' to the beat. Bill, 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 bill. Hit me off. They should have hit me off with some salt, but we ain't gonna go there. I'm gonna let it go. I'm gonna let it go. I'm gonna let it go. I ain't gonna even trip. I ain't gonna even trip. I ain't even gonna stunt. McDonald's, how much you charge me for this? How much you charge me for your little farewell goodbye? Bye bye, McRib. What would it look like? What it look like? What it is? Now I got a large. So the McRib large joint got the nerve to say sweet tea. All you gave me was was spray. I didn't say sweet tea. But you put water large sweet tea. 989 73 cent on the tax. Came out to 1062. Alright? Whatever. Let's get back to it like we never left. I'm gonna open up the McDonald's McRib coffin. Ba boop boop. McDonald's. Can I put in a request? And I think I hated it last time uh, y'all had to make red ball too. I hated this bun. Look at this. This bun right here is not fun. This bun is not fun and really has no business with your McRib. Do like a soft bun, a potato bun or something. A long potato bun, you know, or a large, long sesame seed softy bun. A different choice of bread, perhaps. I never really liked this one. I don't know why. But you go to pick it up, it's already broken right here in the center, so you can't even get a full grasp on the McRib. Now, I could drop the top in the convertible box for show and show the Ickle Pickles popping on a handstand with some on y'all, with some on y'all, and the McRib slab itself, you know? The mix slab, no doubt. And I, I said that's what y'all really need to call it because McDonald's, we know there ain't no rib. Just It's a, it's a slab of meat. You just call it the mixed slab. Don't don't even play. You ain't got to play no more. People already know what it is, what it ain't. They know what it is. They know what it ain't. Definitely ain't no rib, all right? It might be somebody rib. We just know it ain't coming from the right particular animal. Look, I ain't even trying to play you, McDonald's, but I'm saying if you're calling this the farewell tour, bye-bye, goodbye, are you saying goodbye for 2022? You could be saying goodbye for 2022, right? And if that's the case, you know what, fam? Give me a second. Like, I, like, I don't want to give y'all no misinformation. Let's find out what the McDonald's. My man, you. All right, pull up next to the truck. What you doing next to the truck, huh? You letting the car go by? All right, because, woo, I was about to pull out. I was about to pull out. Oh. The McRib came out in 1982. And basically, yeah, the fare farewell tour is for saying goodbye to the McRib in 2022, but everybody won't get it. The McRib Farewell Tour is rolling out in select cities in California, Kansas, Missouri, North Carolina, New Mexico, Nevada, Oklahoma, South Carolina, Texas, Virginia, and West Virginia. Consumers in nearly 2,000 restaurants and 32 markets can have a final taste of the boneless pork rib patty topped with pickles, onions, and barbecue sauce on a bun, on our trash bun. The bun is trash. I'm going to stump. The promotion runs through January or until supplies last. All right, so that's what the farewell tours are all about. It's touring these particular cities. No, I don't live in none of them. I'm out here in Connecticut. I didn't even say Connecticut. Y'all showed Connecticut. No love. I'm out here in Connecticut. We got it. Or we weren't supposed to get it. Y'all were just trying to get rid of some of these trash buns. And y'all send it to us. Which, in, if that's the case, I, I'm in my fields. But um, let's go ahead and get into it, man. McDonald's. Can, can the 2023 version? Can the 2023 version be better? Than 2022, when you bring it back in 2023. 
family, we're going to do a, a real farewell tour right here on this channel. I'm, I got I to gotta say farewell to the McRib. Because I don't know if it's the pickles or the onions this time around. Or it's a different choice of, of mixed slab. Or the sauce. Maybe it's the sauce that's giving it this pungent aftertaste. Mixed in with raw onion. But I am, I am not happy, dog. I am not happy with this whatsoever. I'm sorry, man. The McRib over years had different variations, a different taste. I pro I like the earlier version of the McRib. McRib 2022 on the farewell tour. Uh, for me, this is farewell forever. This is going to be my final McRib review. I'm not going to do it anymore because it's nasty. It's nasty. The bun is tragic. The onions and the pickles at McDonald's are always decent on a, on a regular burger. It's not working for this McRib. The sauce... Maybe I went with a different sauce this time, McDonald's, I don't know what it is. Uh, the farewell tour <clears throat> is going to be farewell for sure. Uh, and that's uh, full show, uh, S-H-O apostrophe, for the number four show, not farewell tour, farewell for show, all right, because I'm done. I'm d This McRib is nasty, dog. There ain't no other way to put it. Closed casket, grand opening, grand closing. <clears throat> if you guys want to go ahead and you're lovers of the McRib. For 2022, it's closing out. You can go ahead, get your hands on the McRib today. Or if not, later on this week. They're just trying to get rid of whatever stock they have left while supplies last out to January. And if y'all feel the way I feel about it, I guarantee them supplies are going to last longer than January. They're going to probably last until it's time to re-release the McRib. And then y'all going to be like, oh my goodness, we're just going to go ahead and re-release what was left over from the farewell tour of 2022 and give them that. Especially if your bun come out looking like that. Trust, it was part of this this year's tour. <clears throat> if your next year McRib looks like that, it was definitely part of this year's tour. Ah, oh. Oh man, I gotta go back, get myself a triple cheeseburger, get that out my mouth. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, McDonald's, but this ain't it. Not, not McRib is getting worse. Alright, man. McDonald's, your farewell 2022 rib gets a negative two, boo-boo the fool, while Arby's was over there. I think they were swimming at a three-piece. I think they were swimming at a three-piece, so they already won. Arby's beat y'all in the head. This needs to be a farewell forever. A farewell for show, though. Out the door. Throw that thing away. Please don't play. McDonald's, you here to stay, but that McRib ain't today. Do it like that. Do it like that. That, that right there is disrespectful to the taste buds of the people. That's all I got to say about that. That McRib is whack. Get it out of here. Trash and tragic. Trash and tragic. All right. I ain't got nothing else to say. I got to get this thing. This nasty. It's all in my breath and everything. Get, get me up out of here, man. That's ridiculous. And it was funny, too, because I was going to do the McRib versus Arby's little country style short rib. What the hell? Arby's would have definitely won. I, I, I don't even have to take out an Arby. I'm going to tell y'all right now. After doing Arby's the other day, Arby's McRib definitely... Arby's McRib, that's fucking... Uh, Arby's rib definitely beat McDonald's McRib. I don't even have to have the comparison video for y'all. I tasted that one. I, I broke that one down. This one right here, negative two, boo-boo the fool. Yeah. Don't fall, don't fall, don't fall.